well, it's actually at the core of our company. What, all we do is innovation in security. We don't do products that have been doing uh, security or that have been in the security industry for a while. Everything we do has to be either something completely new or something that we think we can do better than the way people are doing. So for example, the way we handle your digital identity, the way we're trying to get you to stop using your username and password and use other forms of, of authentication, that's part of the things that we're working on right now and next year. Uh, well, I, obviously I'll bring everything to security all the time because of my work I have a slightly paranoid mind so I've just given a talk on many uh, areas and many issues related to proximity and how precisely what you're talking about, how you interact with things that you have beside you on what we call now uh, personal area networks and things that are connected to you are leaking that information. So you're probably thinking useful ways of, of dealing with that data. I'm, using, I'm thinking about how to get all of that data and use it against you, right? Obviously to then create a product to protect you, right? But it's massive. That's, that's definitely going to be in the news many many times in the next few years not only next year it's going to be yeah, that's what's coming that's the internet of things and the internet of things is connected and if it's connected it's going to be attacked and it's the kind of things that people just let as they come you buy a fridge connect it and put your foot in you don't get the you don't get to set it up and stuff so it's going to have the default passwords if there's a problem with the software you're not going to update that problem and it's going to be vulnerable for someone to make it, take advantage of that and if it's your fridge then uh, so fine, but what happens when it's your car or when it's your medical device or your pacemaker or something like that is going to be very serious in the next few years.